All right, welcome everyone. This is gonna be a review video on a lure that I've been using for trout. Uh, this is a lure made by the company Creep. It's out of Japan. Uh, this is the, the AIM 46S. So the S means sink, sinking. The 46 means it's 46 uh, millimeters long. Uh, so it's a good compact size. Uh, it, it's four grams in weight, as you can see uh, on the package there. Uh, what I, one modification that I did is I just put, I just took the front hook off. It comes stock with single hooks on it. I took the front hook off because as you can see behind me, I got a bunch of logs and sticks and stuff like that that will get hung up on with that front hook. But I always keep the front hook in my, in my lure box. I can put it on if I'm fishing somewhere that's a little bit deeper or has less snags. Um, All right, the bill, it's, it's really durable. I've been using this around a lot of rocks and stuff like that, and it has not bro broke. It's, it's reinforced a little bit on the bottom right there. Uh, there's some other lures that I, I use in the stream that a lot of times the, the bills will break off. And this thing, I've been smashing this up against rocks. It's a nice one. That's dark. This, this color here, uh, I forget exactly what it's called, but it's a limited edition 2021 color. It does have some chips on it, but I've been using, I've been abusing this lure, throwing it around rocks uh, all over the place. And it's actually been really durable. Most other paint, um, most other paint jobs would have chipped off a lot worse than this. Uh, so I can't really say that this lure is not durable. And you can see here, I don't see any visual cracks. I don't see any cracks on it. I don't see uh, any sort of real signs of structural wear and tear on this. Uh, sometimes what can happen is back here by the hook tie, uh, you can get a little split there in the, in the wood or the plastic in most lures, but this lure has actually been really durable so far. I mean, for this lure not having an internal weight system, so what I mean by that is a lot of times there's like a, a magnet with a steel ball bearing in there that'll, that'll slide. There's no rattles or anything in it, but it still casts really good and really straight. Uh, sometimes when you have lures that aren't balanced well, they'll cast inconsistently. So some, sometimes they'll cast like this, or sometimes they'll kind of flop around and then like your hook gets caught up in the line. I haven't found that to be an issue at all with this creep aim. One thing I like to do to get the most amount of action is using a snap. Just, I just use a small, this little owner, this is a triple zero size uh, snap that I use on there. And, and that way I take the front uh, the front split ring off and I get a lot more action out of this. And I switch my lures a lot. I can just go like that, switch my lure and, and I'm done, just like that. So right, right here is a really good way to test the, the, um, the way that the, the, the lure swims. Kind of like the versatility I like. So there's some faster currents up here. There's a slower eddy through here. And you're going kind of up, like down current, and then cross current, and then going up current. Sometimes your heavier, your heavier JDM trout baits, uh, they're really good at cutting through heavy current and having good action in there. But then when you get to areas that it slows down, it takes a lot of rod action to be able to get action out of your lure. Uh, I haven't, I haven't found it to be too bad with the creep. It does tend to sink a little, like a little faster than I'd like. But for the, the sheer versatility of a lure, it's actually really good. Like I could tie, if I'm just going to tie one lure on to, fi to trout fish anywhere, it would be this lure. So as you saw, it's a pretty versatile lure, uh, able to fish this like shallow, faster current, also some of that slower, deeper current as well. So for your one just all around versatility uh, stream fishing lure, I definitely look at the Creep Aim 46S, that's what this is. Available in the US at baitfinesseempire.com. Uh, very, very reasonably priced and also with those two single hooks, it just makes it that much better of a buy as well. Just ready to fish right out of the box. So stay tuned for more trout fishing stuff and subscribe and also make sure you follow me on Instagram. I post a lot of different pics on there. You can kind of see what's coming ahead in YouTube videos that way. So stay tuned and thanks for watching.